हमने डिस्कस किया था लीज फाइनेंसिंग को वी विल कंटिन्यू ऑन दैट टॉपिक सो वी नो सो फार दैट व्हाट इज लीज राइट we also know the different types of lease we have seen the tax treatment of the lease what are the benefits of using lease because lease works uh, just like debt in the same way uh, the debt can help us to reduce our tax liability lease can also help us to reduce our tax liability and then we also saw some other effects of lease on the financial statement uh, especially on the balance sheet so in the balance sheet uh, we have to show our debt and assets but if we are using an operating lease although it is uh, like a debt but we don't have to show it in our debts on a balance sheet so in this way the businesses can actually hide their debt and can show their financial position better to the outside investors right so today we will be talking about lessee's analysis of lease how the lessee will evaluate the lease whether it is beneficial for them or not and also we will talk about lessers analysis of lease then whether giving uh, asset on a lease is beneficial or not for the lessers because they have made an investment they want some return and some other minor issues so let's start with the lessers analysis <clears throat> we already know that there are two parties in a uh, lease one is the lessee and other is the lesser uh, he is actually owner of the property and entitled to some payment uh, which can be called rent uh, lessee is actually just using the property so he has to pay some rent to lesser so lease must determine whether leasing an asset is less costly than buying it so if we are lessee then we have two options either buy asset or get it on a lease So we have to compare both of these which one is more beneficial for the company which one has less cost okay simple on the other hand if we are talking from the perspective of lesser we have to think about as an investment like you you made a 1 billion investment bought some property and now you have rented out that property and you are getting some rent you have to make sure that the return on your assets are sufficient enough to <clears throat> sufficient enough uh, for the capital you have invested therefore you have to compare your return on asset with other assets other assets return 
For example, you have to see the return on alternative asset. You have two options. One is rent it. Other is start a business in it. So return from renting it or leasing it must be higher than return from starting a business. Right? So you have to make sure that buying an asset and leasing to another party is worth deal. Basically, lessers usually have some benchmark. ROA, if the lease is giving you minimum of that or equal to your benchmark, then it is worth. If it is not, then you have to think about doing some other business.